cool. So it's, it's now about four, five, five. So what, seven, seven more hours on it, which is okay. As you can see, it now has a door. We still get into it that way though. But yeah, so more coats of paint on the outside. All around it, looks nice. That's now the roof. It's got a rubberoid finish to it, two coats, um, which should help keep it waterproof. I think we're gonna use that on a lot more stuff. It's really, really good. It's Thompson's, Thompson's 10 years of seal. That stuff. It's pretty good stuff from the looks of things. The inside of it as well looks like a, a, um, a sauna room, a Swedish sauna room. The pine's really, really nice. The floor is now completed, which is good. Um, yeah, just need to do a stop on the door properly. And we still need to sort out this wall here. I think temporarily that's literally just going to be covered in something. And we've got some leather as well down there from an old sofa. Let's use to coat it. That's it for this week. Again, I'm going to be popping around and doing some other little bits for the roof and covering the sides and like filling bits like these um, where you can see that it's dried and it's cracked apart. So probably some clear. What's it called? Clear what now? Oh, what now? Clear silicon? Is it silicon? Yeah, is it silicon that we're using to seal it with? Yeah, clear silicon to seal those up with. Got like a nice bond around those. Still need to sort out the wheel arches. Didn't get a chance to do those today, which is annoying. Need to come up with something better than just a box of wood. But yeah, we'll see how that goes. Um, and then we still need to build the little patio area, which would be nice. Um, yeah, that should be good. Done, I'm going home.